minor. News. CBC News live in your community broadcasting from MTS Iceplex and the Indigenous Minor Hockey Tournament. In its 27th year, teams from right across our province are here this weekend. And so is Manitoba's Minister Responsible for Children and Youth Opportunities, Kevin Chief. First, may I say, so you're looking awful spiffy. I am. I'm here, uh, not only here in my, in my duties as being a member of the legislature, the, the host organization is, a, is an organization in the area I represent, but I'm also here to do the, the Red River Jig with everybody. So. Uh, I'm here uh, wearing two hats, and I'm very excited to do oh, that. Well, that's great. Yes. Two hats and uh, some tap shoes, too, I yes, see. Yes, that's right. What's the name of the group that you dance with? Uh, the Norman Chief Memorial Dancers. My, it was uh, named after my late father who passed away. Lots of traditional square dance teams do that. They name it after someone who's passed away, an elder in the community. Well, that's, that's a wonderful honor for your dad. It is. It's a wonderful honor for my dad and for my family. So, so many kids around here. You didn't, you didn't ever play in this, compete in this tournament, did you? No, I never competed in this tournament. But as you can see, there is just so much excitement. There's so much energy. I gotta say, you know, they're, they're seeing the cameras. They're see, they saw the, John, the Don Cherry, Ron McLean, and people are taking pictures. So it's just adding so much to this event, and it's yeah. absolutely fantastic. You know, people get to share here, network, celebrate. It's just phenomenal for all the children. Yeah, it's a fantastic atmosphere, and we're thrilled to be here with that booth and the Don and Ron picture that you can have your photo taken with. Yes. Very cool. You're a basketball guy, though. So I'm a basketball guy. I'm a sport guy. You know, one of the things we know is one of the great things that events like this do is they help young people get a sense of belonging yeah. and we always say if we don't give young people something positive to belong to someone will seek them out and get them involved in something negative so we're seeing literally this event alone a thousand children and youth super active in the game of hockey super active in sport and celebrating with their parents their grandparents their aunties and uncles it's absolutely phenomenal real sense of belonging thank you so much for being with us today thank you very much break a leg all right <laughs> okay still to come tonight i'm karen dillon Plumbers are finding other ways to thaw your frozen pipes. So why isn't the city following suit? That story coming up on CBC News Winnipeg. Also coming up on CBC News at 5.30, a survey of civil servants finds a third of them know of fraudulent or unethical behavior. What this says about our government. You're watching CBC News Live from the Indigenous Minor Hockey Tournament at MTS Iceplex.